Hey, and today we're going to get into red belt tipping. Now, from uh, this point moving forward, most of your tips are going to involve doing kata or forms. Um, I have a, some tape in the shape of a cross on the floor here to help maintain some direction. So if you have some tape at home, I recommend putting that on the floor in that cross sheet there. That way, as you're going to the left and the right, up and down the bar of your forms, you can maintain direction a little bit easy. All right, like I said, we're going to start out with red belt today. So first tip on red belt, we're going to be finishing up the last three blocks, double shudo, shaker, and nukiti, also kuma one. And second tip is going to involve doing kuma two. All right, so the first tip on red belt is going to consist of the last three blocks and kuma one. The last three blocks are all going to move forward. So from a kamasi position, we're going to start out with double shudo. All right, I'm going to prepare my left arm. I'm going to step forward with my left foot into a back stance, nice and strong. Arms are up nice and high here. I'm recover, and I'm going to do the left side. I'm going to prepare my right arm. Step forward with my right foot. Nice low back stance again. All right, think about your foot position. Recover. Shaker block, similar to augmented block. I'm going to prepare the right. We forward with my left foot. I have my arm in there for support, right on the elbow, arms up nice and high again. Cover. From the left side, prepare to the left, we forward with the right foot. Right. Again, arms up nice and high, strong fist, low offset horse. Cover. And block number nine, new key. I'm going to block with my left hand, step and spear with my right. Again, nice low offset horse rooted into my stance. Recover. And the left side, I'm going to block with the right, spear with the left. And I'm resting this hand underneath my elbow, not underneath my armpit there where I can have a little bit less support. And I'm going to recover. All right, so those are the last three blocks. Now you're ready to move on to your first kata called kuma one. Now the most important part of your form is going to be your stance. All right, so I'm going to check my spot, make sure I'm center my X here. All right, now keep in mind, I'm going to be doing everything so you can look at me the whole time. So I'm going to be moving in a, a opposite direction if you, if you notice. All right, so here, I'm going to look to the left, prepare my arm, I'm going to step out, outside block, strong back seat, shooter strike in place. Now I'm going to adjust my stance to the right, outside block, shudo strike. I'm going to cross my arms we forward with my left foot, down block up the bar, we forward rising head block, we forward rising head block, we forward punch. Right, nice and centered. Here's my pivot and turn. I'm going to step up, point over my shoulder, turn, and outside block, back stance. In place, shudo strike, adjusting to the right, outside block, back stance. In place, shudo strike. Again, we forward with the left foot, down block. We forward rise and head. We forward rise and head. We forward punch. Step up again, point, turn, and outside block. Shoot or strike. Repeat to the right, block, and strike. My right foot moves last, my right foot moves in, and recover. Just, there you have Kuma 1. All right, now second tip is going to be Kuma 2. It follows a similar pattern. There's just going to be some subtle changes that might make it a little more challenging uh, compared to Kuma 1. All right, so we're going to get started. My position. Again, we're going to begin to the left, this time with a shudo block. So I have this hand prepared for a shudo, back sweeps. Now I'm going to weave forward and punch. Now I'm going to look back to the right, turn into the right, shudo block. Weave forward and punch. Now I can go up the bar, down block, up the bar. I'm going to weave forward, augmented block. Weave forward, augmented block. Weave forward, punch. Now I'm going to turn again. Step up, point, turn, shudo block. Repeating, weave forward, punch. Turning back to the right, shudo block. We forward and punch, down the bar, down block, augmented block, augmented block, punch. Step up, turn in, shoot up, we forward punch, turn, shoot up, block, we forward and punch. And as you recover, you should end right around where you began, as long as you were stepping properly. A couple things to keep in mind when you're practicing your, your last three blocks and your katas is the most important thing is your stance. So you want to be nice and low as you're walking through your form. If you have some teeth and you laid out your cross, make sure you really utilize that for following directions. If you have any questions, uh, don't hesitate to give us a message. All right? Have fun.